Prostate cancer is a challenging disease to treat, but we're making substantial advances in cures through international efforts supported by the Movember Foundation, the Prostate Cancer Foundation, as well as patients and their families. Our research group is focused on advanced prostate cancer, otherwise known as metastatic prostate cancer. That's a particularly challenging disease to treat and has a very high lethality. What we do know about advanced or metastatic prostate cancer it is that it is driven or turned on by testosterone, the male hormone. If prostate cancer is like a car, the engine driving that car is a molecular engine called the androgen receptor. The fuel for that engine is testosterone. The exhaust from that engine is PSA, or prostate-specific antigen, the protein we use to screen for prostate cancer. The goal has been to shut off that engine. One approach is to get rid of the gas, get rid of testosterone at the pump. This generally works for several years, and you see dramatic responses. The problem is it's not a cure, and almost always, the engine is turned back on. So the goal has been to develop new drugs that can target these other methods of reactivating that engine. We now recognize more than 30 different subtypes that have different types of secondary engines to make the cancer grow. For about 20% of them, we have very specific therapies. For the other 80%, that's where research needs to improve our understanding of them and develop better therapeutics. We now think combinations of drugs anticipating how this engine will be reactivated is the way to go. We now think there are ways to image non-invasively the subtypes of cancer that a particular patient may have. So how do we continue to make these advances and accelerate the pace? It really is dependent on support from the community, from altruistic patients that participate in trials, through Movember Foundation, the Prostate Cancer Foundation. These are all required to bring the best and brightest scientists and doctors into the field so we can make advances and cure this cancer.